Hello everyone, welcome to our new video. Our topic today is Tesla and its history. This is the corporate history of Tesla Incorporated, an electric vehicle manufacturer and clean energy company founded in Los Angeles, California in 2003 by American entrepreneurs Martin Eberhard and Mark Tarpenning. The company is named after Serbian-American inventor Nikola Tesla. Tesla is the world's leading electric vehicle manufacturer, and, as of the end of 2021, Tesla's cumulative global vehicle sales totaled 2.3 million units. The founders were influenced to start the company after General Motors recalled all its EV1 electric cars in 2003 and then destroyed them, and seeing the higher fuel efficiency of battery electric cars as an opportunity to break the usual correlation between high performance and low fuel economy in automobiles, the AC Propulsion Zero also inspired the company's first vehicle, the Roadster. Eberhard said he wanted to build a car manufacturer that is also a technology company, with its core. Technologies as the battery, the computer software, and the proprietary motor. Ian Wright was the third employee, joining a few months later, the three went looking for venture capital, VC, funding in January 2004 and connected with Elon Musk, who contributed 6.5 million US dollars of the initial, Series A. 7.5 million US dollar round of investment in February 2004 and became chairman of the board of directors. Musk then appointed Eberhard as the CEO. J.B. Straubel joined in May 2004 as the fifth employee. A lawsuit settlement agreed to by Eberhard and Tesla in September 2009 allows all five, Eberhard, Tarpenning, Wright, Musk and Straubel, to call themselves co-founders. Musk took an active role within the company and oversaw Roadster product design at a detailed level, but was not deeply involved in day-to-day -day business operations. Eberhard acknowledged that Musk was the person who insisted from the beginning on a carbon fiber reinforced polymer body and that Musk led design of components ranging from the power electronics module to the headlamps and other styling. Musk received the Global Green 2006 Product Design Award for his design of the Tesla Roadster. Presented by Mikhail Gorbachev, and he also received the 2007 Index Design Award for his design of the Tesla Roadster. From the beginning, Musk consistently maintained that Tesla's long term strategic goal was to create affordable mass market electric vehicles. Tesla's goal was to start with a premium sports car aimed at early adopters and then moving into more mainstream vehicles, including sedans and affordable compacts. Musk's Series A investment round of $7.5 million US dollars in February 2004 included Compass Technology Partners and SDL Ventures, as well as many private investors. In February 2005, Musk led Tesla's Series B $13 million US dollar investment round which added Valor Equity Partners to the funding team. Musk co-led the third, $40 million US dollar round in May 2006 along with technology partners. This round included investment from prominent entrepreneurs including Google co-founders Sergey Brin and Larry Page, former eBay president Jeff Skoll, Hyatt Air Nick Pritzker and added the VC firms Draper Fisher Jurvetson, Capricorn Management, and the Bay Area Equity Fund managed by J.P. Morgan Chase. Musk led the fourth round in May 2008 which added another $40,167,530 US dollars in debt financing, and brought the total investments to over $100 million US dollars through private financing. Eberhard served as CEO until he was asked to step down from the position in August 2007 by the board of directors. Eberhard then took the title of President of Technology before ultimately leaving the company in January 2008. Co-founder Mark Tarpenning, who served as the Vice President of Electrical Engineering of the company, also left the company in January 2008. In August 2007, Michael Marks was brought in as interim CEO, and in December 2007, Zayev Drory became CEO and President. In January 2008, Tesla fired several key personnel who had been involved from the inception after a performance review by the new CEO. According to Musk, Tesla was forced to reduce the company workforce by about 10% to lower its burn rate, which was out of control in 2007. In May 2008, 
the Truth About Cars website launched a Tesla death watch, as Tesla needed another round of financing to survive. In October 2008, Musk succeeded Drury as CEO and fired 25% of Tesla employees. Drury became vice chairman, but then left the company in December 2008. In December a fifth round of investment turned into debt financing and added another US$40 million, US dollars, avoiding bankruptcy. By January 2009, Tesla had raised US$187 million US dollars and delivered 147 cars. Musk had contributed US$70 million US dollars of his own money to the company. On May 19, 2009, Germany's Daimler AG, maker of Mercedes-Benz, acquired an equity stake of less than 10% of Tesla for a reported US$50 million. According to Musk, the Daimler investment saved Tesla. In July 2009, Daimler announced that Abu Dhabi's Aber Investments bought 40% of Daimler's interest in Tesla. 2009 Department of Energy Loan In June 2009 Tesla was approved to receive US$465 million US dollars in interest-bearing loans from the United States Department of Energy. The funding, part of the US$8 billion US dollars Advanced Technology Vehicles Manufacturing Loan Program, supported engineering and production of the Model S sedan, as well as the development of commercial powertrain technology. The Low Interest Loan Program was created in 2007 during the George W. Bush administration and is not related to the bailout funds that GM and Chrysler received, nor are they related to the 2009 economic stimulus package. Tesla repaid the loan in May 2013, with a US$12 million US dollar interest. Tesla was the first car company to have fully repaid the government. Nissan repaid their loan in 2017, Ford expects to repay their loan in 2022, and Fisker went bankrupt and defaulted on their loan. The company announced in early August 2009 that it had achieved overall corporate profitability for the month of July 2009. The company said it earned approximately US$1 million US dollars on revenue of US$20 million. US dollars. Profitability arose primarily from improved gross margin on the 2010 Roadster, the second iteration of Tesla's award-winning sports car. Tesla, which like all automakers records revenue when products are delivered, shipped a record 109 vehicles in July and reported a surge in new Roadster purchases. In September 2009, Tesla announced a US$82.5 million US dollar round to accelerate Tesla's retail expansion. Daimler participated in the round to maintain equity ownership from its initial investment. Low to supply of Roadster parts Tesla Motors signed a production contract on July 11, 2005, with Group Lotus to produce gliders, complete cars minus powertrain. The contract ran through March 2011, but the two automakers extended the deal to keep the electric roadster in production through December 2011 with a minimum number of 2,400 units. When production ended, needs update, mostly because of tooling changes orchestrated by one of its suppliers. In June 2010, it was reported that Tesla sold a total of 12.2 million US dollars zero emission vehicle credits to other automakers, including Honda, up to March 31. 2010. In our next video, we will continue with IPO and Model S. If you enjoyed our video, please like and subscribe, and feel free to share your thoughts in the comments. Stay safe and healthy, see you soon.